Yo, what's good, your brother? We can't be bad with nothing. Actually, no cat. Today we got my, uh, we got true, uh, my brother horror story anime. I'm saying before we make sure like I'm sure. My name is Lance. Lance, this what's good, Lance? When I was 13. Oh, you was 13? Okay. My older brother, I was 13 Carl, when I lost my virginity. Fast forward eight years, bitch, you still feeling me? Drop six racks on the pants and then. Yes, sir. Came over to our house. Watch how I'm finna be. Their names were Jack, Hennessy. George, Max, and Steven. They always liked to hang out in the living room, and usually when I was there watching TV before they came, my brother urged me to go to my room, Damn. which annoyed me a lot. I always liked snooping around my brother's room, since he had a lot of cool things in there. He'd always catch me later on and yell at me to get out of his room. One day, I noticed that one of his friends, George, stopped coming over. I asked Carl about it, but he said they weren't friends anymore. I believed him and forgot about the situation. Right, then I started cheap, to realize that my brother was spending a lot of time upstairs in his room and told me not to enter his room at all. He sounded really serious, so I stopped snooping around in his room. His room began to smell really oh bad. Oh my and God. I asked him what that disgusting smell was. He nervously said that it was some of his gym clothes, and for some reason, I believed him. One day, my parents had gone out, and it was just me and my brother that were home. I was in my room playing on my PlayStation when my brother walked in and asked me if I wanted some pizza for dinner. I immediately said yes, because it's pizza. It's my favorite food. He nodded and then told me he was heading off to the pizza place. Before he closed the front door, he told me, please don't go in my room, and left. A few minutes passed and I got bored playing on my PlayStation. So I began snooping around in my brother's room. You gonna see a dead body, I know, bro. I completely ignored my brother's rule. But I'm that annoying little brother that makes you want to just smack me. I started going through his drawers, but didn't find anything interesting. As I made my way to the my bed, that doing familiar, shit, bro. disgusting smell began to come. Oh, it's gonna be on the bed, bro. I bed to see where that source of the smell was. I then realized that the oh, my was God, he underneath been... his bed. I bent down and peeked underneath the bed and found a human-sized duffel bag. I began to panic because I thought the oh, bag was Oh my and as I God. unzipped the duffel bag, I saw my brother's friend, George, dead. The smell was coming from George's body. I screamed and ran out of the house. I ran over to my neighbor's house and begged her to let me in. I explained to her what I just saw in my house and she called the police. The police waited for my brother to come. Dude, that's home. crazy. When he did, he was immediately arrested. It turns out that George had stolen $200 from my brother, and this angered my brother and caused him to beat George to death. I'm sorry, but no amount of money will cause me to take someone's life, bro, especially my bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, fuck, bro. I know 200 is a lot, bro, but like, that's crazy, bro. You kept, that's crazy, bro. I don't even know what to say, I bro. didn't understand. My brother was such a nice person, and I couldn't imagine him doing something Over like money, this. bro. He was sentenced to life in prison, and I haven't seen him since. It was a walking menace, but you know what I'm saying? If you enjoyed that reaction, make sure you comment, like, subscribe. Comment.